I'm lazy, so I built a thing. I'm going to show you how. Check it out. Alright, so today we are going to build dispensing containers for nutrients because I'm lazy, I don't like going up and down the stairs, and I don't like making nutrients one gallon at a time. So, take a look at what we need. A couple of five gallon buckets, battery powered pump from Amazon, it was like 12 bucks. Um, you'll see it just has a tube that attaches to the bottom, full spout, power on top, charge it with USB. Gonna need a drill. I've got a half inch drill bit on here just to make a big enough hole. In my case, I'm gonna put it just inside this rim here um, to give enough room for the pump to sit and also for the spout to reach out over the edge. Piece of cake. I am also gonna put one right here in the middle. I'll tell you why. If the pump is accidentally turned on by, say, a pet or a child, um, this way I will be able to have a drain hole. So I just have to turn it every time I'm not using it so the spout is over the bucket. And it should drain most of the water back in there. All right. So you'll take the bottom of the tube. There's a little uh, plastic grommet fitting thing that you can't see because it's blurry. Here it is. Feed it to the bottom. Set your pump on the edge. And now you just have to fill the bucket. So what I'm going to do, so I'm going to make another one of these real quick. I'm going to fill this one with veg or grow mix uh, nutrients. And I'm going to fill the other one with bloom mix nutrients. So that I have both on tap. The blue bucket is water only. So I'm going to have 15 gallons of fluids down here for all my hydroponic growing needs. All right, we have five gallons of water in each. I have hydroponic nutrient supplies. This will probably be the last batch I make with the Flora series, but that's just because I'm almost out and Dyna Grow is easier. So I'm gonna mix these up real quick and then you'll see them in action. All right, so I have mixed up nutrients, grow here, bloom here. You see, I've got my pumps sitting on top. They just sit here. Nothing magical about it, right? They go, like I said, after I'm done, I turn them this way so that if cat turns the button on, it's not going to flood the basement. And now all that's left to do is show them in use. All right, so I've got a shishito here that I'm going to transplant into a bigger container. So instead of having to go mix up a gallon, I can just push a button, catch it in my bucket using a coffee can here and I've got all the grow formula I need so again this was made out of sheer laziness because uh, I don't want to go up and down the stairs all the time so now I have nutrients and water available in the basement super simple project anybody can do it uh, you know these pumps were 12 bucks on Amazon I can put a link down in the description a couple of buckets and that's really all you need so if you enjoyed this video please hit like Subscribe, and check the bell. Peace. Hey yo, I grow that hotness so y'all can watch this growing journey on my way to be a botanist. I got this garden game on my kid. You just spice it up and grow like bosses. I grow that hotness so y'all can watch this growing journey on my way to be a botanist. I got this garden game on my kid. You should spice it up and grow like bosses.